in the first place, uh, I will uh, thank the people of media for the coverage this morning. On behalf of the Catholic Sudan and South Sudan Catholic Bishops Conference, I'm standing here welcoming His Lordship Christian Kalazar, the new Bishop of the new diocese of Bantu. We are receiving him at the airport this morning as he's preparing to be installed for the new diocese of Bantu. And uh, people are many this morning to receive him, uh, to welcome him, and to strengthen him, to introduce him to the new mission that he's going to take. And we are here also trying to support him and uh, to get ready that the new mission is entrusted. And uh, this is one of the gifts of the Holy Father when he comes to the South Sudan and uh, he has given us uh, the new diocese of, uh, of Bantu. And uh, we are grateful for that. And uh, I don't have much. We received him. Uh, and we welcome him uh, to the new mission. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much, uh, the media and all the believers uh, of Bentiu, uh newly established uh, diocese. I'm here uh, with Honorable Angelina Yainteng, the Minister of Interior. We have come to join the believers of uh, Bantu Diocese to receive our new uh, bishop, uh, Christian Lazari, the former uh, bishop of Diocese of Rumbek. Uh, these are the fruits of the visits of His Holiness, the Pope, to South Sudan last year. And we all know he, uh, he advised us uh, to live in peace, the word of peace were repeated in his um, uh, message to the people of South Sudan. And as we are living in peace, we have uh, this, the new, newly established uh, diocese of Ventiu, and this is a great uh, honor to the people of Western Upper Nile, uh, greater unity, and uh, the people of uh, South Sudan. Uh, he is uh, on his way uh, to Bentiu, where he will assume his new uh, um, uh, position uh, as uh, a bishop of Bentiu uh, Diocese. Uh, I'm honored uh, on behalf of the organizing uh, committee and the reception uh, committee uh, to have uh, this uh, wonderful uh, reception and this will continue all along in Bantu and elsewhere in greater unity. Thank you. I give thanks today to God for his mercy and his uh, love for the people of South Sudan and in a special way for the people of Bentiu. We call it now Greater Bentiu, uh, Greater Unity, which is a unity state and also Rueng administrative area. And it is with uh, great joy that I welcome the erection of this uh, new diocese, which is a gift for everybody. And for me, is a sign that God wants to be close to us and the church with the Holy Father and the bishops and all priests uh, want to be close to the people of unity uh, to journey together towards peace and reconciliation and especially get that liberation, or we call it salvation, that God is 
uh, preparing for us, which is life to the full. And so I acknowledge also the suffering of the people of this area, not only because of the past conflict, but also now the, the flood. I see pictures with people that are really caring to protect that little land they have to live on. Certainly it's very painful, but it's also a great call of, for unity. Unity state cannot be saying something different, but unity to make a space that we can really live and witness the love of God for us. So I'm really moved to see the presence of so many people that came to the airport now, and I think we celebrate these days together with joy. I have a delegation that accompanied me from Rumbek. Uh, of course, this morning we prayed, and also last Sunday we prayed, and I think they feel like I am a gift from Rumbek given to unity. And we were reflecting about the way that we are also called to reconcile these two great communities of South Sudan, where the border that is there, we are so close, but sometimes also so divided. So we will put down that border that will divide people, but create bridges and roads that we can really be united and also enjoy eh, the beauty of our country together. So all the people of Rumbek are greeting you, especially the priests that accompany me uh, uh, and many that accompany me spiritually. And I also thank uh, the ministers, first of all, uh, Minister Angelina Teni and all the others that came together and the people uh, that you are here together at the airport welcoming me. I, as you said, the first bishop of Bentio, it's a great honor for me to be welcomed by you to be the first bishop of Bentio. But certainly we are first all together and we have to build up this special time that is given to us.